Hi, my name is Autumn and this is Left-Handed Knitting. Today we're looking at Make One Left and Make One Right. Uh, these are commonly used for uh, sweaters around the shoulders where there's increases uh, to allow for your shoulders. There's normally four, two in the front and two in the back, and they go together in pairs. Make one right and make one left uh, will work together. So we're gonna do those right now. So normally in the pattern, it'll say to knit until one stitch before the marker. So this, uh, we'll take care of that really quick. Just normal knit. There's another one. Knit, okay, now we're one stitch before the marker. And when you're making a um, make one left or make one right, you always grab these little guys that are in between the stitch. These are stitches, these are stitches, and then the this is the crossbar between the stitch or the cross thread. So in the case of a make one right, we use the right needle to pick it up. So we're gonna go around and in front, it's a little tricky to do, but you'll get the hang of it, and pick it up just like that. All right, now in this case, uh, we have to knit it in the back. You don't wanna knit it in the front. So we take our left-handed needle and we knit that stitch through the back and then we knit like normal and sliding it off. There's your make one right. And then you would knit this stitch like normal and you've actually increased a stitch because that stitch wasn't there before. Now we slide the marker over and we're gonna do the same thing. It would ask for a knit one no problems there and now it wants to do the left hand the easiest way to remember it is right use the right-handed needle left use the left-handed needle so when you uh, are doing a make one left you pick up this cross thread here and you just pop it on to the right hand needle that's pretty easy the uh, make one right we did in the back the make one left we'll do in the front and it's pretty easy because uh, it's tighter here you can feel like it's a normal stitch so we push that through, go over, pull through, and then slide off. And there's that make one left, there's that additional stitch. And then we would knit like normal. Now we've only done this for this one row, so you won't see much of a difference, but as you continue to do this, what you'll see is the make one right starts slanting, and the make one's left starts slanting. And it's really important that you follow the left-handed knitting guide when you're doing this because uh, if you watch any right-handed videos, it'll give you the opposite instructions. All right, thank you.